smooth on Unreal Engine it's not up there. Yeah, the usual, it's like every time you do a move for the first time, there's like some sort of hang-up. A glitch bound to forever feel left out, bound to forever wander these planes alone, without any purpose or destination. Guru, nice to see you too, Rumi. Okay, bye. Alright, lovely stuff there. There's no heavy attack. There's only an R1 by the sound of it. Off the hang-ups. Oh no, is this a roguelike? Yeah, I'm just gonna blindly pick things. Wow, I'm so engaged. Looks like you can dash through people. Ow. No stamina, you can just mash. like does a 180 really suddenly to block Do I need abilities to get to those doors, or... Well, I don't need one for that door. Maybe it's just the reward for these rooms of bits. Yeah, could be. Oh, whoops. Mindlessly mash. Yeah, they don't even wish punish me, so you know. Key, what's up? I'm playing dog chat. Yeah, can we go in? Cool! I love dog shit. They introduce me to new enemies, but hide them behind me. That's a great start. Going for baseball to start in a couple of hours. Ew. Roll back. Very tactical. Cool, what's this? Double jump permanent mod, sick. Wowie.
Whoopsie. Health would be cool. My open PS4 to see if Lucas is back yet and see how he's doing in his Yu-Gi-Oh! tournament today. Oh, he's going offline? The Madman. Increases base physical damage. Okay. Well, health would be nice. Uh, health? Anyone? Gamma. How about just a run button? Ooh, maybe you can buy health. Who this? Damn, she's vaping? Wearing some weird... They're not even like gun shoes, they're just like... Steampunk high heels. Please take a look around, I assembled these just for you. Thanks. Every Sunday he plays IRL tournaments at his local shop. Okay. Base physical damage. Well, I got loads of money, so I could just do what the fuck I want, really. You buy everything. Yeah, it's a bit dinosaur-y, which... You know, just seems a little superfluous, but whatever. Guess this is meant to be boss waves? Ah, oh, shit. Done? Can I destroy this? Oh, okay. Don't know why it's flashing then. Slicer, cut through obstacles and enemy shields. Okay. Oh, you mentioned the dying so thing pretty much immediately. These guys are getting destroyed. What's this shit? Ooh, adrenaline, 100% damage when near health, near death even. Gain immunity when hit. Half a second. 20% additional damage per nearby enemy. That's great when they run at me, like morons. Two waves. I gotta get these little shits first. How, how the fuck does this work? I just hold it, okay. Rising. Yeah, it's just not as interactive. Like, I'm literally just holding it down. It says aim, but that's just turn left and right and rotate is... Yeah, I'm holding the white stick up and it's going vertically and holding it right it goes that way. So, vaguely, vaguely. 20 damage to enemies when glitching through them. They must mean that. Yeah, it's not a very well-balanced game, so you can just run up to people and cut the shit out of them and not really think too much about it, but I guess it's fine. Anyone else in here? No? Shots? Right, health this way, money that way. I wasn't too fond of Metal Gear Rising. Well, I, I think I just generally don't like Planum games that much. I 
take it. Oh. To the shop. It's you again, Vapor. Take a look around. Thanks, Limp Biscuit. Slice of damage up. Get immunity. I see minus 600. Fuck. I can still buy this, though. Boss wave. Spaceman. Aw, oh, shit. Uh-oh. Oh, what, what a name. Great. Oh my god, the performance keeps fucking stirring. Alright, it's like Dark Souls, let's learn the pattern. I like how they just have that random techno crucifix here. Souls 3 boss. High frames. Yeah. Oh, God. Jesus, take the wheel. He's too handy. <laughs> He's too <laughs> just, just DPS him. DPS him. Fuck it. DPS him. What a boss design. Dude, what if there was like an astronaut with a claymore and then he picked up like this obsidian cross with purple neon stripes on it. You fucking sick. Heterotroph. Permanent mod. Allows Goro to unleash a furious attack that damages enemies and destroys obstacles. Wow. Crunchy. Another boss? Or is this going to be the end of the demo? Whoa. Damn, I don't have a cam. I totally acted up there. <laughs> Me too. Damn, is this real life? Someone's gone mad with their filters. Jump the slam. Uh... Oh, okay, cool. Okay, eight health. Three thousand money. Try not to die. What the fuck? These guys have way more health. Still just hit stunning them to death, though. Oh, don't want to come from a weird angle. Damn. Clearly too much skill. What, what does bloody hand mean? Like attack up or something? What's, what's the other symbol? Money. Yeah, uh, I'm, I'm fine for money with my three grand. I've only ever seen uh, 1 and 2, and after watching 2, I completely regret watching 1, because 2 just feels like they did 1 again, but way better. I've never seen Army of Darkness, despite people praising it so often. Well, so often. Occasionally. Oh, dogs. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Larry in it. Network. Hello. Nothing will change. You have to understand that. What do you want from me, Glitch? What are you doing? What exactly are you doing? Waiting for me to show up again? Oh well. I expected this to be straight trash, and apart from it hanging sometimes when you go into a new region and hit someone for the first time, it's mostly been alright. The only issues are... 
that you can simply just mash R1 and there's no stamina, so you can just hit stun shit tons of people. The shield guys were a problem, but then I got this thing that just cuts through their shields. So, yeah. There's no, like, interesting 1v1s. I think the thing that killed me is like a dog or something. Grant strength against overwhelming odds. Yeah, we had that. Nukitsuki? First slice marks the enemy. Marked enemies receive 50% additional damage from regular non-slicer attacks. Allows drawing your slicer and executing a strike in quick succession by tapping the slicer button. So, I like that. Wow, so I got a, a reason to combo buttons now. Cool, I guess. Uh, he's doing. He's been doing great without you, Key. Just fine. Money. Oh yeah, this thing. What if we had even more money? Four waves. He's been, yeah, his injuries aren't as bad as they used to be. He got uh, a decent score in Division 2. He got promoted, a good, which is a good thing. You may not know what promotions are key. What's this shit? Attack up. These guys do get marked, but the marker appears to be inside of them, as opposed to above them ahead. Yeah, it appears inside of them once they die. Right, what's this shit? Increases base physical attack damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take no shot. It's a mildly interesting thing to do. Don't I have a double jump? Yeah, cool. Let's see if I can get past uh, the astronaut a second time. Oh yeah, I'm not using triangle in like just regular battles. Guys, watch any Overwatch 2 gameplay yet? No. I saw that there's an article about it, like uh, hours of Overwatch 2 beta gameplay. Uh, but no, since no one's been shoving it in my face, I haven't watched it. 
Take this, take that. 300, easy. Don't care what the fuck I bought. Next. What's the point if this game isn't coming out for another four years? Oh, Overwatch 2, you mean? People love watching uh, other games that aren't coming out for fucking years, you know? Except at that stage, they don't know they're not coming out for years. How different is Overwatch 2 gonna be? That it won't come out for four years. Thing. All right, why well, we got a choice here? Um, dash, I guess. Muni on hit. Strength overwhelming odds. I'll get this because I think I accidentally bought one and it cost me 600. So let's just get them for free whenever possible. You can do that, Key. You can't force us to watch it though. I swear, what happened to this guy? He, like, despawned and then I cut his corpse out of the air. It was already gone? Do I want more money? Or is it is it money or is it going to be the shop? I think it's just money. Let's go this way. Do you want to make a whole story co-op mode while reworking all the heroes and multiplayer as well, creation of new maps? Yeah, well, I imagine they've already been working on it for a while, though. Shit and slow. Give me thing. Uh, yeah, we already got this. But you know, okay. Health, money, eh. What's this shit? 500 tactical three part component that allows us for overclocking the system. Coolant consumes coolant. What is that? Hold dash button to activate. Oh, and now I can't buy it anymore. Oh well. Consumer. I swear he just does the same attacks in a row. Yeah, now uh, Shockwave and Grand Pound. Neil. Consumer slain. The cosmos weeps. Okay. Yeah, we've already got that. I don't remember her standing here this last time. 
See you soon? What you mean by that? Demo's not over. Oh. Exactly, they think they know shit. Right, so it was just a bunch of dudes running at me, and then the next one was a bunch of dogs that kind of exploded? Smashing. Right, uh, blade up, I think. Yep, this is the room. That's just wave one. Okay, some shit comes out the floor. I'll grab whatever this is. More damage. I think that's all it is. Shop. favorite customer? You mean the only one? Why do you even run this business? I need the bits. There's something I'm saving up for, but it's really none of your business, final boss. Uh, I can buy everything. Is this guy, is this game appealing to, like, you guys? Do you look at this game and think, damn, looks sick? Or you're like, wow, this looks like shite. Turbo shite. guy doing up there. What the fuck are you? Yeah. Anyone? Waves of enemies? Oh, I'm hearing footprints. Footsteps, even. What's going on? Okay. Oh, there's one guy. Visually, it's appealing. Combat seems simple, but serviceable. The least appealing thing seems to be the enemies. I'd agree with that. They need to sort of just make them more engaging. My brain is definitely turning off for a lot of this shit. What the fuck? You could fuck off. Feels like when you got to this region, their health just tripled. Nearby enemies, um, 100% more damage near death. Am I technically near death? Because I'm flashing red here. My life bar, anyway. This health? Yeah, this is health. Visually appealing. Well, it's, it's, it's something.
You don't even need to dodge to avoid their gunfire, just simply walk to the side. More health, I've already got 3k. Only one wave? Boss? No? Okay, get the fuck out. What the fuck? What's up there? Punk. Two waves. People? Fight people? No, die you little prick. Ah, oh, it's like they, they, you just can't kill them when this laser thing is on them. Where is he? It's up there. Okay. Last area is just generic, but the effects of the attacks and that whatnot are good. Brains of the laser is bullshit. Yes. Especially if you just stand up here. I can make it easy to get back to the fucking thing. That's getting money. That's not store. Some good health would be nice. You can leave mini heals, but then they're instantly gone. Two waves. Oh god, there's holes. Hmm? Lasers? Ah, oh, fuck off. Is that it? I kind of hear lasers? To the left? Yeah, there's an dash. Yeah, get fucked. Ah, the fuck. Oh god, no, wrong button. Er. More iframes. Health, but only if I get through these waves. Don't fall down. Okay, well that first wave was really quick. Yeah, I see the speaker phone. To the store. Ooh. 450. I think I can afford all of this. Yeah, the shop's clearly not balanced around what we have. Fuck. Respawn? Usually in levels when you fall off the stage, it just says roll back, and then you're respawned up the top, I guess, because it's a shop. They didn't bother with that. 
Maybe. <sighs> May have found a bug here, guys. Load game? Or continue? Uh, oh no, because we went back to the beginning, is it? Never mind.